Ken Moyes, an RF engineer for pointing antennas, and I just wanted to explain to you how Omni antennas radiate. So here we have a radiation pattern of an isotropic antenna, which means energy is radiated evenly in all directions in space. As we focus the energy more on the horizon, your gain increases more and more and more. For this antenna that I have in my hand, which is an omnidirectional antenna, the radiation pattern would look something like this, with your energy going around evenly in 360 degrees in space and getting less and less as you move up in space yep. in elevation. Okay, here we have an example of a good radiation pattern for a low gain on the antenna and a good radiation pattern for a high gain on the antenna. And the reason that they're good is because you can see that energy is radiated evenly everywhere on the horizon for this antenna in 360 degrees around and it's similar for this antenna. And as you can see, this is a low gain antenna because the radiation pattern is broad on the horizon. It covers quite a large sector, whereas this one, the energy is focused very tightly on the horizon, which means you don't get a lot of movement in elevation, but you get a lot more power on the horizon. For these antennas, as you can see, as you move around on azimuth, in 360 degrees, your radiation pattern goes from high energy to low energy and so on as you move around in 360 degrees. Which means that when you've got an omnidirectional antenna, if you're rotating in your vehicle, you will go in and out of signal strength as you rotate, which is really not ideal.